big weekend this one. We got framing stuff for work surfaces, work surfaces, the rest of the chipboard and insulation, and a James. Hey! So we've got a ceiling to do in here. We're just gonna get this light down, get all the plastic up, get all the insulation up, get all the boards done, get that painted, and then I can work on work surfaces. Exciting. simple probably crap um, for people who actually know what they're doing a little skeleton everything's got a gap of what I think is about a fridge um, still haven't decided exactly what I'm doing fermentation wise so I might just get a load of fridges um, but that will ruin my potential storage space so I haven't decided yet we'll work something out but that gives me some options I've had to charge my phone James had to leave but I've been busy and we now have work surfaces. Ah! I'll show you properly, we'll turn it around. Here we go, that's the far end of the brewery as you walk in and then a drop down to where the brewery kit itself will be and then back up over the other side. Uh, this just allows us to be able to see in over the top in fact, I haven't put the kegs on there yet, so let's try that. There they are, in situ. They won't look like that. They're not finished. They won't be worth brewing first with in here, but that's pretty good, I'm, I'm enjoying that. So they're at a height that I can see into them, which is good. If anything, they're almost a bit lower than I expected, but that's fine. Extractor fans build up there. Well, we're getting somewhere finally. Big day in the brewery. Um, got a bar top done. That was my practice run for the other surfaces. None of that could have happened without James sorting out the ceiling pretty much single-handedly as well. So um, that was massively appreciated and a huge help today. Um, but now, yeah, we're close to that first brew. Now that we've got surfaces to brew on, um, all I've got to get done is the extractor fan unit. That should be relatively simple, I hope. So within the next couple of weeks, we can down tools. Um, although we won't be brewing with the kit that I want to be brewing with, you know, get a brew done at least. It'd be really good to get that done in here. Other than that, it's chilly in here, but I couldn't resist having a nice uh, beer in the cold at my bar. <laughs> Thank you for watching. 
Um, if you've enjoyed this, then please hit the subscribe button. Hit the little bell so you get told when part five comes out. There's other parts that you might have missed already that you can see on screen. And uh, really appreciate all of the um, kind words, views, and subscribes that we've had so far. Really appreciate it. Thanks very much. <laughs>